Assalamu alaikum viewers this is uh, Heather Ali from Azhar Goat Farms and Forestry so today we have changed the mode of language that we use to uh, uh, communicate with you I have turned into English because our honorable guest uh, understands and speaks English uh, easily so that's why I have asked uh, sir to give his views regarding his visit yesterday on uh, Sindh Institute at Sindh Institute of Animal Health and uh, I would uh, like him to introduce himself sir how are you sir I'm fine thanks. so sir uh, what is your name what is your designation and uh, what uh, views you have regarding the visit that you did yesterday at Sin Institute of Animal Health Karachi I am a veterinary epidemiologist my name is Giancarlo Ferrari I'm from Italy yes and now I'm in Pakistan because of uh, I'm working as a FAO consultant now, before I was animal health officer in FAO. Yes. And now, because uh, there is an initiative from the World Bank to redirect uh, some of the funds which are used under an emergency program for locust, and they want to focus on lumpy skin disease. So I'm here to to support the World Bank in developing this new component of the mm -hmm. project. So that's why yesterday I was visiting uh, I was visiting the, your institute and I I can tell you that I was very impressed yes. very positively impressed for for several reasons, I think I will explain to you which were the most important for me. First of all, I noticed that the, the people that I met, the people that I saw working, they are very much engaged, they are very much motivated, they are involved in what they are doing. And I think that this is coming from the vision of the direct, of your director general, Doctor Nazir Hussain Kalur. Doctor Nazir, yes. That's the first thing. The second thing is that I have seen that a lot of activities yes. are coming. New activities are coming. New constructions, 
new initiatives that you are taking. And I think that that's very important. I mean, it's not very important because, you know, you are building an FMD space uh, or you are trying to improve your, you know, vaccine production and all these things. But the most important thing to me was that, and again, I think this is because of your director general, he has a vision, he knows where he wants to go. Yes. He knows where, you know, he wants to bring the, the incident. I think this is very important. And I was really favorably impressed because of these efforts. Because of these efforts, because of the vision he has, I think it's... So, sir, uh, can you please elaborate that uh, has uh, his efforts been going in uh, negative uh, uh, waves or positive waves? I think it's going in the very positive way because, yes. uh, well, he, he, well, obviously he has a, a knowledge of, you know, the situation in the in the province in Sindh, mm. but uh, I think it goes in the positive direction because uh, the I think the mandate of the Animal Health Institute in Sin is to support farmers through the provision of diagnostic services, yes. through the provision of vaccines, through the provision of assistance for whatever they may require. And I think that the efforts that I was able to see mm. and the, the approach that has been used in order to deal with the lumpy skin disease, which is a new disease for you. You didn't know this disease until November yes. 2021. Yes. But I looked at the way through the presentation that Dr. Nazir has made just now, but through the discussion that we had yesterday, the way you have approached, the accuracy of the data that you have available with you, all the information that you are able to generate, the strategic thinking which is behind every action that has been taken, I think these are very, very positive signals. Thank you. Thanks, sir.